Hi, my name is Robert Ray. We're here at the world headquarters of Under Armour, and I'm here with one of the founders, Scott Plank. So uh, there's a lot of talk that's been going on about Google Fiber. Mm -hmm. uh, how is this going to improve the consumer experience and allow you to connect better with your consumers? Robert, um, thanks for coming to visit us down here at Under Armour. Um, as we look at everything we do with our product today, everything, the way our consumer interacts with our product is on field. Mm -hmm. But more and more our consumer, mm -hmm. and we and how we have our conversation with our consumer today is online. So how are we going to become a very fast organization, and how does Baltimore become a more fast city? Mm -hmm. We think that you know, high-speed broadband is probably one of the most important things to our future success and the success of other you know, young companies in Baltimore. Under Armour uses digital and online to have thousands of interactions with our consumers every day. Um, a faster infrastructure will allow us to have more efficient, richer interactions with our consumer, whether it's browsing our product catalog or um, you know, interacting with the social community or um, learning more about the story of the, brand, of the Under Armour brand. We want to be the employer of choice in mm -hmm. Baltimore and in this industry, in the athletic industry. Uh, our vision is to be the athletic brand of the next generation, mm -hmm. of this generation. Okay. This generation wants bandwidth, okay. and this generation employee wants bandwidth. They want to be able to work 24-7. The sun never sets on Under Armour. We have employees throughout the country. We have employees throughout the world. We've got about 2,500 employees now. Mm -hmm. I manage about 500 workstations in four offices between here, four offices in Baltimore, and, and then another office in Amsterdam, another one in Guangzhou, China, another one in Hong Kong. Mm -hmm. And you add to that 43 retail stores, that's a lot of employees, and they're all of a certain demographic. They want bandwidth. They want to be able to work from home, I guess. Absolutely. They want to be able to collaborate. Abs and VidCon. You know, we want to do a lot more uh, video conferencing between uh -huh. not just our campus here. It, it, it's hard to get from one building to another at this point, but also to be able to do VidCon between here and China, right. where I can hold up a, hey, here's a new shoe. Do you like that design? No, no, tweak this. Move so your designer code. would actually, while Absolutely. they're making a garment, they might show a picture of the garment to a colleague in another country? Is that yeah, true? and, and okay. we've been working on, on that for a year, year and a half. but. It always comes down to bandwidth. We just don't quite have enough bandwidth. We're here with Brian Griffin, the director of sports marketing and a specialist on one of the new combine projects that you're working on. So how would a, a, your combine project, first of all, what is your combine project? And then I guess the next question is how would that benefit with a gigabit of broadband from Google? Combine's an event where basically athletes come to participate, challenge themselves in different elements of testing whether it be like a 40-yard dash or a vertical jump or a broad jump, and also get critical skills development through coaching, uh, micro games like seven-on-seven, one-on-one, uh, -on -one, individual. So whether it be in football, whether it be in basketball, whether it be in baseball, each sport has certain elements that they test to determine. Okay, so how um, would that program benefit from having a gigabit of broadband? Well, first and foremost, the digital community is probably the most important platform that we have around Combine because this enables us to stream live content in terms of different combines and different camps and different clinics and also different training experiences as, as people are seeking knowledge on the internet. They're looking for that uh, information that can show them the ways to train better, the ways to improve. And so this is consistent with what we're trying to achieve globally. Okay. And that content and, and how it's delivered is very critical. And so the high-speed internet and, and the opportunities that Google's putting forth to these different communities is really right in line with where we're taking Com on. Great. Well, thanks a lot for taking time out of your day to come down and talk to us. Well, thank you guys.